Good afternoon, everyone. Hello. Gonna set it all up. Just thought I'd give us a few minutes. There we are. Got it up. I got the right. Have I done the right task? But yeah, we got three people in there already. Is that true? Oh, and Josh, we got three people in there. I've only been on one two seconds. How's that possible? Yeah, it's the power of TW. I'm trying to see are the, are, the, are the tags in place? I did put tags in. You know where where um when somebody recommended me? Where somebody recommended I put tags in, Josh. Yeah, you see them? Cool, right. Excellent, that's a good start. Right, just bear with us two minutes, mate. I just need to write in this. I joined this TW group on Facebook, so I'm hoping to uh, get a few more on there. How's your day been today, Josh? You been all right? Well, I've done that thing on Facebook, so hopefully that will get some people in. Hello, hello, uh, wrestling guy. Good afternoon. I can't believe literally I came on and I already have three people in there. You're in two groups. Oh, okay, Josh. Josh, uh, try and advertise my... my uh, I've had got advertised in the one. If you're in a different one, send me the link for the other one and I'll join that afterwards. That was it, David. There you go. Sorry, wrestling guy. I couldn't remember. I forgot your name. I apologise. I'll just give it a few more minutes and then we'll get cracking. I need to set it up because the annoying thing about this OBS software, as Josh will know, is... Yeah, don't worry. I'm still here, by the way. Don't worry. Don't panic. Screen's gone black. There you go. I'm still here, see? Uh, let me load up. Oh, TW's already loaded up, isn't it? Okay. Let me delete this. Just give me two minutes, Lance. I should have done all this before I came online, shouldn't I? There we go, and uh, there we go. Go, and I'll just expand this. Right, everyone can see that. That's it. There you go. I had a look at um, Twitch stream, Dave, um, David, sorry, and um, let me just go on it now. Let me just see if I can go on it now. Might be easier, as you said. I don't know how to do it on this. Which thing I've got? No idea. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, I appreciate you letting me off. You, yeah. Um. Yeah. So basically, I've got the Twitch Studio up on here, but I've got no idea how to add. I'll well, just click on Start Stream. Start Stream. Go live. Connection issues. Looks like you've been having some trouble with the connection. Okay. Um, right. I'll just end this stream on this. I'll, uh, I'll look into it, Dave. I'll look into it. Don't worry. Um, I had a quick look today. I completely forgot about it, if I was honest with you. So over the weekend, I'll have a little tinker with it. Oh uh, yeah, but um, how was uh how how are you today, Dave? Have you been up too much? Oh yeah. 
Yeah, you're probably right, Josh. We've got four people in now. Hello, anybody? Hello, whoever else has just joined. Feel free to say hello in the chat. Don't be shy. Um, yeah, you're probably right, Josh. Right. We didn't really do much yes, uh, the other day when we started this. We did start to book WrestleMania, though. So how about we do that? Carry on with that. We have three matches set up. We have the eight-way Money in the Bank match. Uh, you can't see that, can you? No, you can't. Right, bear with us. There you go. So that's a... Uh... Yeah, so we have the eight-way. What have I missed here? Your girlfriends. Oh, I see what you're. Yeah. Oh, you lucky dog. You lucky dog. <laughs> Save the lady killer. <laughs> it's alright for some, innit? Me and Josh, me and Josh, we're struggling to keep the ones we've got. <laughs> I'm only joking, Josh. I'm only joking. He might be um, in a, what they call a thruple. What they call a thruple. You've got three people and they're all in a relationship. He might be one of them. That's, it's quite hip and modern, that is. So he might be in a thruple. It's nice to say as well, isn't it? Thruple. Anyway. So, yeah, so we've got Logan Paul versus AJ Styles versus Ricochet versus Kevin Owens versus Sami Zayn versus Ellie Knight versus Andrade versus Bobby Lashley for the US uh, title. At WrestleMania, we've got Rhea Ripley versus Becky Lynch, and we've got the Bloodline um, Tribal Chiefs, which is Roman Reigns and The Rock, versus the Coalition, which is Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. So, those are probably our three main matches for night one. Let's do night two, and we can go back and fill the, the rest of night one afterwards. I'm just going to um, book them. I'm not going to put, like, a winner or anything because I don't want to spoil it for people. Sisters? What? Hold on. What, twins? Jesus Christ, Dave. <laughs> Josh is really confused. I don't think he understands that you're, at, you're in a three-way relationship with a pair of twins. He's just very lucky, Josh. He's just hit the jackpot. Just let him let him win in life. I don't think so. You're getting worried. I don't. Uh, I don't think they have threesomes in the bedroom department. I could be wrong, but I don't think they have threesomes in the bedroom department. I think they're just in a freeway relationship. Am I right, Dave, or am I wrong? Have I got this completely wrong? Dave is probably trolling us at this point, and he's having a laugh at our expense, Josh. We will soon see. This is more. This is more of drama than the wrestling I'm booking here. Right, you carry on talking for a minute. I'm going to have a think what I'm going to do. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh no, we've got to do the obvious match, haven't we? Uh, you probably can't see that either, can you? No. All right, I need to add another screen. In my soul, something, something, Cody Rhodes. Right. I feel like Dave's trolling us, Josh. I think it's too much like Jeremy Kyle for old Jerry Springer. I, I mean, if it ends, I'm not trying to offend you, by the way, Dave. If that's what you, if that's, if that's what's happening, fair play to you. That's all I've got to say is fair play to you. 
Here we go epic we'll go epic uh open match script all out match slow build overbook decisive win simple win Allow high risk moves, allow spinal impact moves, and storyline. Right, so that's hold on, what's going on here? Universal, there we go. What? Who's the champion then? Yeah. Um, oh, we've got a vacant. Hmm. Oh, the champion. Oh, what's going on here? Sorry, everyone, I'm talking to myself. Just bear with me. Ah, there we go. Right, there we go. I've corrected it. You couldn't see what I was doing then. I, for some reason, the Universal Champion was uh, vacated. Yeah, Dave, we weren't having a go, by the way. We weren't taking the piss or anything. If you're happy, you're happy. I mean, we're only jealous. I think, I think, if, um, I think if Josh could have a relationship with two women, I think he would. I wouldn't because they're too much hassle. I love my girlfriend to bits, but I couldn't have two of her. I'd have two of them nagging at me one after the other. <laughs> wow. You say that, Josh, but I don't know. I've only got one. Hold on. I need to open up a new screen to show you, don't I? Hold on. Let me do. Let me get out the pre-booking thing, and then I'll show you in a second. Yeah. All in. I will shut this in this way. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Let me just get out that. Right, so let's have a look. Let me see if you can see this titles. My Valentine's Day. Um, yeah, it was all right. Probably not as good as uh, Dave's, though. <laughs> but yeah, it was all right, mate. It was. It wasn't too bad. How was your Valentine's Day? Did you and your your lovely your lovely wife? Did she have a nice Did you have a nice meal together? He looks. He looked happy from what I saw on Facebook. I need to. Uh... I need to find this title belt. WWE. I am here, by the way. I'm just trying to find the um, a picture of the current WWE title that Seth Rollins holds. Make it a bit more current. So I will check the chat in a second. I'm a typical man, I cannot multitask. Right, let me just check what's going on in the chat room. Oh, the Ivy, look at you. 
It's all right for some, isn't it? Okay, I've got to find it then. I've got to find it, and I. Dave, did you do, did you get up to much for Valentine's Day with your uh, your lovely ladies? What did you get up to? I don't mean that in a dodgy way. I mean, as in, did you go out? Did you have a nice time? I have found a photo. We'll call it WWE Pharaoh after Pharaoh Roche. The Ivy's Ed like it's posh and stuff, but the price is pretty much similar. So, okay, that's not too bad then. What did you have for dinner then, Dave? Anything good? Did they make it you? Or did you make it for them? Who end up cooking? Still can't believe you're in a bloody fit. Uh... So it's just, I'm just very jealous. Hello, Bazinga. Nice to see you. Bloody hell, Dave. It's all right for some. Bazinga, um, basically, um, we have a new person in the chat called The Wrestling Guy. He's been on the last couple of times. And uh, he is in a freeway relationship with two women. They are sisters. They are twins. He's a very lucky man. So there you go. Uh, my my um my Valentine's Day was all right, thank you. How was yours with your your lovely partner? Did you have a nice time together? All right, can you see that on the screen? There you go. Got a photo of the WWE title, the Pharaoh Roche title. So there we go. Yeah, I posted in a Facebook group about TW, so you never know. We might get more people in here. But um, I appreciate your your support, lads. Even if I only end up having you three in here, I'll be happy, man. Yeah, why is that too? Yeah, we need to get rid of it. You're right, Josh. I didn't realise what you're on about at the time. All right, we need to. Oh, hold on. Which one's which, though? How? Why have we got two? That's the Pharaoh Roche belt. So why is. Hmm. Do you know what? Do you know what? Hmm. No, we'll leave that. Get rid of this one. This one here. We'll get rid of this one. We are retired about. There we go. Problem sorted. I need to go back into pre booking for a second. Hold on, why have I... Where's the universal... Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, Japanese barbecue. Mm, that's all right for some. 
hello to the other person that's joined the Twitch chat. Feel free to say hello. Um, yeah, you should start your own. You should start your own Twitch stream, um, Dave, with you and the twins in a hot tub. You two make millions on here, mate. Trust me. I want ten percent though for giving you the idea in the first place. Okay. All right. So the title situation is that. All right. Let's go back to booking. Uh, I hope you can let me know if you if you can't. Oh, hold on. No, hold on. All right. Let me check and see what's going on in the chat. I'll be in a hot tub soon because me and my girlfriend are going to a um, cabin lodge for my birthday in June, and it's got a hot tub. So there you go. Still can't believe you're, you, you've you somehow got yourself in a relationship with a pair of twins. How does that work, though? Do they get jealous of each other, uh, of the attention you give the one? Do they get angry with each other? I feel like you're going to be end up on a true crime documentary at some point. I'm just really worried about you now, Dave. So I'm booking Seth Rollins versus The Rock. Um, I'm not obviously going to give away who's going to win. Um, but yeah, I'm going to protect The Rock a bit. Pull it in the ring. Mm, all that match. Overbook. Decisive win. Win for win. Basically, we're starting a feud with the Bloodline against Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins, and we're going to end both of them, both of the storylines. Oh no, I can't end it there, can I? No, it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, we're going to end it there as well. So we'll just do that. You book. That's fine. That's two of the major matches for night two WrestleMania. Looking forward to it, Josh. I do I do like your diaries. Um Dave and Bazinga, I highly recommend that you read Josh's diaries when he posts, when he finally gets around to posting. He is very good at um, stuff like that. So, yeah, he's my right hand man on here, but he's very good at doing his own thing as well. Right, we need, oh, I know which match we need to book next. Can you see what? Yeah, you can. All right. So I've put Bailey versus IO Sky for the SmackDown Women's title as well. Yeah, no worries, Bazinga. Um, yeah, I'll see you in a minute, Josh. <laughs> you both went at the same time. <laughs> 
But yeah, Dave, um, you're gonna have to teach me the secrets. You're gonna have to tell me how you do how you do it. Is this your first ever thruple relationship, or have you been in other thruple relationships before? How did you meet your twin girlfriends? Right, so look, we've got three matches for night one, three matches for night two. Um, right, I need to sort out the titles, they're all over the place. Titles, let's get rid of that and I'll vacate it. Oh, other, uh, retire it. Play that one. Too many bloody titles. Tie this one. Tie that. Oh, I retired the wrong bloody thing then. I shouldn't have retired the women's one. I'll have a look in a sec. I'll just see if anybody else is. Oh, yeah, carry on. Actually, I can bring the women's money back, money in the bank thing towards SummerSlam, which is what I was aiming for anyway. Let me just see if there's any here. Why is it not letting me click on these? Very annoying. There we go. Right, okay. Yeah. Anyone back? Oh. You still with us, Dave? I hope, like I said, I hope we haven't uh, offended you. You see that. All right, Austin Fury, Grayson Waller, where are you? Where's Grayson Waller? Hmm? Where are you, Grayson? Hmm. Where are you? Where's Grayson Waller gone? I accidentally deleted him. I did get rid of quite a few wrestlers, and maybe I have accidentally deleted him. Oh no. No, I don't want to quit. What am I doing? I've got to find out what Grayson Waller's his real name is now, see if I can find him. What was his wrestling name before that, though? Matty Wahlberg. Should have just been called Matty Wahlberg, shouldn't he? Well, he's not on here. 
Hmm. Right, let's have a look. There we go. Let's have a look at that. Um, in game editor, in it. No, no, no. Import data, in it. Import data. Edits. Grayson. No, oh, not Stu Grayson. Matt Wahlberg. There we go. Matty Wahlberg. Import. I somehow accidentally deleted Grayson Waller. I do apologise for that. Uh, let's see if we can find him on here now. Yes, there he is. So I've got to sign him now to a new contract. There we go. Oh, we've only got two in here now. Shame. I think he dropped off. Um, sorry, Dave, if I, if me and uh, Josh offended you. He's still there. Let us know. If you're not there, sorry, mate. I was just curious. That's all. Right. Uh, so we can't do Austin Fury, Race and Waller tag team yet. I don't think we've got Chad Gable and Otis as tag team yet on here. Should do, shouldn't we? They're called. Oh, it's all right, mate. Don't worry. Don't worry, Josh. You you come back when you're ready. Um, what is the name of Chad? Something Alpha. Is it Alpha Academy? I think it's Alpha Academy. Isn't it? Chad Gable and Otis. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Alpha Academy. That's it. There we go. Alpha. There we go. Not them. Uh, I'll have a quick look. WWE tag teams. WWE tag teams. Uh, let's have a look. See if I've missed anything. Any of these out? Yep, so we've got American Alpha. I need to add them as a stable as well. And I've got this. Stables, where are you? Stables, there we go. Can you see what I'm doing? Yes, you can. Good, good, good. Uh, add stable. Alpha Academy. So, hold on. We've got. Oh, there we are. There we go. American Alpha. Alpha Academy, sorry. Um, Babyface. Must involve Chad Gable. So we've got Chad Gable as the leader, Otis as the deputy, Hiro Tozawa as a member, uh, Maxine Dupree support, and then we've got Julius Creed member, Brutus Creed member, Ivy Nile member, and that should be support as well. There you go. It's American Alpha sorted. Zingo, are you back with us?
having a quick look at the tag teams in case I've missed any. No, I think I'm... Oh, yeah, I lost the areas. There's Legado, there you go. Let me just check tag teams and make sure we've got them as a tag team. No, we haven't. Okay. Lost Lotharios. Angel Gaza and Okay. Um right, let's see what else we've got. Yeah, Shayna Baszler and Zuri Stark are attack team. So we'll add them. We'll suggest the hunters. Yeah, what that'll do. We'll call them that. Uh Pretty deadly, we're signing them. Street Profits, we've got in Holy Union, we have. Oh. oh, we haven't signed them yet, have we? Okay, so we won't have that team just yet. Right. Um, let's carry on booking WrestleMania then. So, I don't know what I'm going to do about the tag team situation. I know that we could do with having Jay Cargill in a big match, I think. And I think her and Bianca Belair would be a big match. So let's put that. Bianca Belair. Hold on, I don't need to do that, do I? Why am I allowed? Uh, there we go. Bianca Belair, Jade Cargill. 15 minutes. We will keep strong Jade Cargill. Protect her as well. Keep it simple. Jade Cargill is still a bit green. Go uh, with the crown, see if that works. Open match, script, all that match, slow build, decisive win. Anybody else is in the Twitch chat? Feel free to say hello. Let me know what you think. Um, it's gone a bit quiet. I know Josh is busy. Zinga should be back in a minute, and uh, Dave has unfortunately disappeared. Now, you might be back in a minute. Yeah, I think I need to uh, give Bron Breaker a showcase match. I'm thinking Bron Breaker. Oh, I keep doing that. I don't need to do that. I'm thinking Bron Breaker versus. Let's see what we've got on the heels side. Not wrestling already in there. So there we go. So we've got mm, maybe Dominic Mysterio. Oh, I know what I was going to do with Bron Breaker. I completely forgot. Walter, there you go. That's what I was going to do. I don't want that. Car crash, maybe? No. Still the show. And then we'll do open match. Script. All that match. Oh, slow build. Dice of win. And then Allow that, allow that.
Oh, I need to change something on that. Modify. Let's change this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Right. We need to add another storyline. We need to add Ron versus Walter. Now, Bron Breaker, Walter, and then we'll add Giovanni, Paul, and Ludwig. Support. Right, so we've got four major matches on each night, I think. I think that's how we've done it. Um, I need to add Jade Cargill as well. Versus Bianca Belair. Can't type today, I do apologise. What we could do is have them initially as a tag team. Um, and then, so we need Asuka. Ah, then again, Asker and Carrie saying already in the storyline. Um, no, it's all right. We'll just we'll have them in two storylines. It's fine. No, not yet, Josh. I'm doing all the preparation stuff, mate. I probably won't do a first show until later. I'm trying to get WrestleMania night one and two down, and then I'm trying to get Elimination Chamber down, and then that way I can work away, work from that. I think. If you want, though, I can just. Oh, we have got the Royal Rumble in 27 days. I could do with booking Royal Rumble, couldn't I? Uh, I won't book the Royal Rumble matches. I'll just book some of the. The yeah, pre-book match. We do. I'll just copy what happened in the last, uh, the last Royal Rumble match on uh, that pay per view. We can do like we'll just I'll just repeat what happened in the last Royal Rumble. So the Royal Rumble is going to be a bit rubbish because it's literally you literally going to know everything, but that's what we'll do anyway. Right, Bailey. Oh no. Um. Logan Paul. There we go. Logan Paul. Kevin Owens. US title Logan Paul Do Mayhem Um Kevin yeah. Owens Open Match Script all that match, slow build, oh, oh, what have I done there? Okay, that's fine. Right, so, open match. We do EQ finish, there we go. Uh, we need to add this as a storyline then. Right, Logan Paul versus Kevin Owens.
All right, that's Royal Rumble. That's the first match Royal Rumble. We'll have a match Cody Rhodes. Won that. So we've got, we got four matches in the Royal Rumble, so this will be very easy to book. It even tells us how long we need to do a pull, so that makes it easier as well. Um, Always single. Roman Reigns, AJ Styles, LA Knight, Randy Orton. How many minutes was that for? 19. And we'll do that. Do that 19. There we go. Universal Championship, if I could find you. There we go. Getting there, Josh, by the way. Uh, yeah, we'll just assume I'm doing it on purpose. <laughs> uh, I don't want to give away all the secrets. You know what I mean? Now, you know what's going to happen with the Royal Rumble because I'm literally just keeping it to what it was in real life. So I will, I will add it now. Bear with us. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see that one. What can't you see? Hard on that. Add Windows EW4, we'll call it. There you go. I think that's what you wanted to see in it. Yeah, that's better, isn't it, Josh? Is that any better? No, if I did it real time, we'd be there all day, won't we? Once I get it all set up, how I like it, because on the weekend as well, I'm going to be setting all this up anyway. It's just I've only just, I haven't had enough time. I'm literally, I'm still, I'm still going through every single wrestler, whether they're, whether to sign them for NXT or for the, the WWE roster. I'm only down to the letter R at the moment. So I've still got all that. I've still got all the wrestlers re left on there. Still got to finish pre-booking all the like WrestleMania and then working my way back. So I'm hoping to do some of that on the weekend, but I am I have a busy weekend as well. So we've just got to do it bit by bit. It's just gonna take me a lot of um, time, really. I hope it's not too boring for uh, other people though. All right, now you can see what I'm doing a bit better, it might make it easier. Uh, the storytelling. Tech Roman Reigns. We'll put limited, no, we won't put limited involvement. Open match. All in the ring, all that match, slow build, overbook. We do Randy Orton. Tapped by Sarah Sapoy. Or Heyman at ringside. Yeah, I know. I know. Maybe I had too many. I don't know. Oh, God. I, thought, I can't imagine what it'd be like for you booking New Japan with all their, with the G1 and all that lot, jo uh, Josh. That would drive you mad, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's a bit boring because it's a bit long. It's not as, um, it's not as easy to navigate, is it? Like, 
football manager. It's a bit of annoyance. So, um, yeah, right. We need to do the both Royal Rumble matches now. Royal Rumble. There we go. It's the Royal Rumble. Right. How long was this one on for? This men's one was 180 minutes. 108 minutes, so that's 68 minutes. Okay. Um, I do need to re add. I got rid of because there was too many tiles, it was doing me in, so I got rid of the Raw Rumble ones. And now I need to add them again if it lets me. It won't let me, Josh. It won't let me go down. What I need to do is do this one. That's easier. Right. Will you let me do it now? There we go. We add, we'll re add this one and retire. Where is the men's? Where are you? There we go. And retire. So we're going to retire them now. Easy. Why? Where are you now? Why can't I? Hmm. Royal Rumble. Is that? What have I done here, Josh? Let me know. Uh, why can't I add Royal Rumble? Ah, oh, let me just leave it as none for now. We'll just book it. Oh. Ugh, what's gone here, Josh? Uh, hello, whoever's just joined the Twitch chat, feel free to say hello if you want to. Uh, I'm trying to book the Royal Rumble exactly how it was booked before. Uh, I'm really confused because I'm trying to figure out. Ah, oh, there we go. That's why I got confused. Sorry. Yeah, it's Royal Rumble for both. Both. I was trying to find the Royal Rumble title because I retired it and then unretired it, but it won't let me. It won't let me add it to. So whoever wins the this Royal Rumble match, uh, I need to figure out how to do that. All right, so we've got the Usos. Jay, Jimmy, can't add Grayson Waller yet because I accidentally deleted him somehow. Andrade, there we go. Of Melo Hayes, Kinsuke Nakamura. Uh, Santos Escobar. Karen Cross. Oh, well, Karen Cross is no longer here, so we won't add him. Uh, you never know. I might. I, I might have a couple of surprises up my sleeve for people in the Royal Rumble. Dominic Mysterio. Alito. Bobby Lashley. I am still there, Josh, don't worry. Um there will be times where I'm gonna be busy doing this though. So. What did you uh, what did you get for Valentine's Day off your partner then? I got my partner some earrings. She's yet to get me anything because she 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 said that we she said that we weren't supposed to get each other presents for Valentine's Day and I and I went against my word and got us some earrings. 
So she reckons she owes me a present. But I don't think she'll get me anything. With Kaiser, Austin Theory. In Bala. Cody Rhodes. Bronson Reed. Yeah, you spend a bit of money on her. Fair play. Yeah, that's why my partner doesn't like... That's why my girlfriend doesn't like celebrating it because she says it's just a waste of money. Whereas I, I, I feel like I'm the woman in the relationship and I said, I feel like we should celebrate it. And I, she's like, no. So, um, yeah. It's one of them things, though, isn't it? Trophy. How did you run From Breaker. Oh no, hold on. Oh, going too far ahead of myself here. Right. Walter. Ivar. From Breaker. Yeah, I took um, my girlfriend out for uh, an Italian meal, and that cost me about 40 quid, and then I spent about 25 quid on the earrings. It doesn't matter how much money you spend. My, my girlfriend's not high maintenance. Um, but yeah, it, it is quite costly when you add all the little things up. But I don't mind. Once a year. So... Can't have Omos in the Royal Rumble because he is not on WWE roster as I got rid of him before I started to say. I'm not going to bother with Pat McAfee either. JD Donahue. There will be some spaces left in this so we can, we can have a few surprises. I've got one big surprise up my sleeve and I'm not telling you, Josh. We'll just have to wait and see. Our truth, the Miz, Damien Priest, CM Punk. Luckily, in this safe, CM Punk's not injured. Thank God. Or is he? Hold on, is he? Ah, he's not injured. And we've got Ricochet. Iron, Iron Drew McIntyre, as I like to call him, Iron Drew, and Sami Zayn. So we've got four spaces left in the men's Royal Rumble match, so that will be interesting. You not filled all of the competition. Well. Fine. Really annoying. Who else can we have for now? We'll add Tazawa, we'll add Gaza, we'll add Dawkins, we'll add Cruz. There you go. Are oh, you happy? There we go. No, I haven't seen. Um, hello, JVR. Nice to see you again, buddy. How are you today? Oh, I love Galaxy, by the way, Josh. Galaxy Chocolate's my favourite. Yes, Omos, I can't stand him, he's boring. Um, did you see any... Uh, no, I haven't seen any New Japan stuff for a long, long time. I do want to watch it, but I just don't have the time um, because I really want to watch the last show or two that they did. Yeah, don't worry about leaving spaces. I know who I've added. I can delete them um, when I book the match itself, so it's fine. 
Yeah, they might. United Empire might come with Osprey. Uh, you never know. Right, let's go about booking the women's match. Battle Royal Rumble. Hold on. Search. I just want to see if it just says women. It's a bit sexist that it says Battle Royal men, but not women. Nah, it doesn't. Oh well. Right. Royal Rumble. How long was this one for? Go so back up here. Right, the women's Royal Rumble match was one hour and five minutes. Sixty-five minutes. Yeah, I heard um, Brian Danielson and Zack Zaver Jr. had like a, another match of the year contender. And um, how was Tanahashi versus Okada for the, probably the last time? Was it any good? All right, so the women's incredible match. Oh, okay. No, I think you were saying incredible match, Brian, Dan Brian Danielson and that, weren't you? How was uh, Okada versus Tanahashi? Yeah, I still. I mean, everybody's saying that Okada is going to go to. Uh, he's, he's literally confirmed to go to AEW, but he, he, until he signs, you just don't know. Do you? Anything can happen. Right, let's do the women's Royal Rumble match now. So we go, female, Natalia, Naomi, Bay oh, Bailey. Candice LeRae. Ah, can't book Jordan Grace. Indy Harwell, where are you? Did I get rid of Oh no, there she is. Indy Harwell. Asuka. Maybe Nile. Any chance? Bianca Belair, Ari Sane, yeah, but if I, I think if he was gonna, leave, he wouldn't. If he was gonna go to AEW, he wouldn't necessarily leave New Japan, would he? He wouldn't. He would say to him, "Look, I'm going to go to AEW, but I will come back to New Japan for special shows." Because AEW and New Japan do have a working partnership, so I don't know why he's having a tearful goodbye. Because even if he goes to AEW, there's always a chance that he'll wrestle in New Japan again. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think it's as. I, I don't think it's as a uh, guaranteed though. We'll see. I'm happy with Okada to go anywhere because he can have dream matches or great matches with. Anybody, whether it's AEW or WWE, I think for me the more enticing matches are in WWE for, for for me to want to watch. I've seen him against Danielson. I've seen him against other like I've seen him against Omega. There's not really any fresh matches from there. Oh, we have got bloody Kaylee Ray. Um. to change their names on here in a second. All right, Chelsea Green. Piper Niven. Where are you, Piper? Ah. Could have sworn I signed you. Oh, I don't know. I'll sort it out in a minute. All right. Zai Lee. That's Zai Lee. Some of them have got their real names because I added them on the, de on the editor. All right, Selena. Maxine Dupree, 
Can't have Maxine Dupree. Don't know why. Nia Jax. Oh yeah, I got rid of Nia Jax because I can't stand her, so she's not in there. Lotsky. Um, I don't know. I don't even know if Dewdrop's on here either. Dewdrop's? No, nah, Dewdrop's not on here either. I had to. I think I've had to sign her because she's she wasn't on the WWE roster, and I think I forgot to add her on the. I don't think I forgot to add her actually. I don't know. I'll check in a minute. I'll finish this first, and then I'll have a look. We've had his shots. See, and then we're gonna add Becky Lynch. Uh, Haley Ray. Shayna, Bahala, Maya Yim, who I refuse to call Mitchin. She's always Maya Yim. Stupid name calling her um, Mitchin in the first place. Right, Zuri Stark, Roxanne Perez, who we haven't got on the main roster yet. Jay Cargill. Tiffany Stratton and Liv Morgan. So for now we'll just add other ones like Alexa Bliss, uh D Fab, Armella, Charlotte Flair, Coda Koi Akai, Isla Dawn, there you go. We'll just pre book that. What the match the time of the match is more than the okay. We'll just leave it, we'll just take it down to 60 minutes. Then there you go. All right, that's the Royal Rumble booked. Now we just need to, I need to change a few of these women wrestlers. Some of their names are weird. They're not meant to be their names. Need to change Maxine Dupree as well because she she shouldn't need to be a manager. She should be a wrestler as well. Why is it not letting me do that? There we go. All right, wrestler. Uh, just quickly add. Uh, Royal Rumble. Uh, we'll get rid of Charlotte Flair and we'll put in Maxine Dupree. There you go, Maxine Dupree. Say, we book. No. You're still with us, Josh. Sorry, mate. I know it's not the most exciting time at the moment playing this. I think everybody else is buggered off as well, but it looks a bit. <laughs> right, roster. Ah, uh, that's annoying. I've got Alba Fire as a heel, and then I've got Isla, Isla Dawn as a baby face. I'm, I'm having to do, I'm going to have to do a bloody angle at some point to turn Alba Fire. Right. The, who else? Lacey Lane is not called Lacey Lane. She's called Aiden Carter. Not a bloody heel. Because I changed the gimmick, that's what it was. 
Um, check if there's anybody else. He needs to be called Zia Lee. No, it's alright, Dave. I was just, well, you buggered off. I, I, I thought I offended you. As long as you're alright, mate. I hope I didn't offend you when I was asking you about it all. I was just intrigued. I've, I've never met anybody that's been in a three-way relationship before. Just, just the curiosity got me involved. I hope you're enjoying the uh, me trying to book all this. I know it's not the most exciting of it. So... What day is that on the air? So we're looking at week one, January, Monday. So we've got the first Monday of... So if I have a look on here, WWE Raw, January, week one, 2024. I'm going to try and book Raw exactly how it was booked in real life. We've got to do some storylines now, just to go alongside it. Um, storylines, there we go. We've got, oh, I can't do Becky Lynch versus Nia Jax because I got rid of Nia Jax. We'll ignore that. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We need to find somebody else for J Becky Lynch to feud with until WrestleMania. Do female, do role, wrestler, do heel. Uh, I don't want to do Rip maybe. maybe. Ooh. There you go, there's an idea. Tiffany Stratton. Do Becky Lynch versus Tiffany Stratton until we get towards WrestleMania time. Do that. Oh. Oh, I know what I'll do then. We've already got Becky Lynch in a storyline. So what we'll do here is we will add Tiffany Stratton. Ladder. And Tiffany Stratton. Uh, Tiffany Stratton can be... There you go. So... We'll get there, everyone. We'll get there. So, uh, Tiffany Stratton versus Becky Lynch will be one of the matches at Elimination Chamber. So, we're going to do that before we forget. So Becky Lynch versus Tiffany. Uh, oh, what am I doing? All right, Becky Lynch, Tiffany Stratton, there we go. Nice and easy. We will do it as storytelling. Tiffany Stratton Strong. 
Spectre as well. Even our Tiffany Stratton dominate the match actually, so it helps her get over. Open match. Grit. All out match. Low build. Overbook. Uh, we'll do interference as well. Actually, we'll do botched interference. There you go. Anyone want to add any ideas? Um, Royal Rumble, Elimination Chamber. Maybe a match for WrestleMania, let me know. Feel free to contribute, we'll, we'll book it together, if need be. We'll protect Jay Cargill. Keep her strong as well. So we want to push her after WrestleMania. Open match. Script it. All that match. Don't know. Slow build. Slice it. Win. Simple win. Then we will. As always, allow, allow, dance, there you go. Hello, oh, what are we doing for time? Okay. I'm a bit quiet. I hope everybody's not bored too much. I appreciate you stand, sticking with it. Uh, uh, elimination Chamber. We need to do Elimination Chamber matches, don't we? So, we're going to do quite a few Elimination Chamber matches, I think. We do... No, we won't do that. We'll do that one. Uh, who is the... Right, who's the SmackDown champions? What are we doing? All right, SmackDown tag team. Yeah, I already follow him, mate. I already follow him, Josh. I haven't had a chance to watch any videos. I only just followed him the other day. Is he any good then? Probably, probably better than me. <laughs> right, so we've got Finn Balor and Damon Priest. So I'm thinking, oh, they're on SmackDown though. Should they be on SmackDown? They shouldn't be on SmackDown, they're on Raw. Right, I'm vacating these titles. Hold on, let me just double check. Who is the Raw Tag Team Champions? Oh, so they're both. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to vacate these. There we go. 
makes it easier. Right, so, yeah, so we've got Finn Balor, so I'm thinking Finn Balor and Damien Priest versus R-True and The Miz versus the Three Brothers, I think, is the way to go. Actually, no, I won't put the Creed Brothers in it. I think that might be a bit too much for them too soon. Damien Priest, R-Truth, The Miz. And then what we could do is we could do... Hmm. Right, let's have a look at... No, no, no. That's not what I wanted. Uh, male, a team. Here you go, Josh. I'm going to put this out to you. I need your, I, I want your opinion. So we got, so I'm doing a two, like a free, a free tag team elimination chamber match for the tag titles. Um, actually, we need to figure out who's on Raw. So we've got DIY who's on Raw. We've got Alpha Academy on Raw. Um, we've got Imperium on Raw. Um, Uh, we've got new either, or any combination of new day as well, or we can't have the biking range just yet. I don't think so. DIY Alpha Academy Imperium or New Day, who would you have in that in that match? Anybody else? Alpha, yeah, Alpha Academy. Is that you're thinking, Alpha Academy? I just saw your. Uh, I just saw your WhatsApp message. Can you see the tags on here? I think I asked you first thing, didn't I? Just want to double check. Can you see them all right? Tags on the Twitch thing. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, so we won't bother with New Day then. I might uh, I might think about turning New Day heel after WrestleMania. I think that might be one of the booking ideas. Freshen them up a bit. Right, so um or I might split New Day up. We just I don't know yet. I'll figure that out. So we're gonna go we'll either say right, so you're saying Alpha Academy, Josh. So Dave, your choices are Alpha Academy, um DIY or Imperium. Which tag team do you want in that elimination chamber match with? So the other two teams already in it are the tag champions, Damien Priest and Finn Balor. And we've got um we've got basically we've got our troop and the Miz, because they're like in a bit of a feud with Judgment Day at the moment in real life. Yeah, okay. I'll go with DIY then. Right, there you go. DIY. Uh, mayhem. Open match, call in the ring, call out match, slow build, over book. Allow. Oh no, no. Allow. There we go. Oh no. Your instincts tell you that. Can you see that? You probably can't see what I can see, can you? Hold on, everyone. Just need to add something else. You can see Triple H moaning at me. We'll just go Triple H. There you go. Sorry, clicks on the wrong thing. Bear with us. Need that. Oh, for God's sake! I want to expand this, not move it. There we go. Triple H and happy. He's not happy. 
your instincts tell you that the well, that the freeway tag team elimination chamber match were, would not go down well with the fans due to the setup and should probably be avoided. Uh, I'm just going to ignore him. I do what I want, Triple H, not the other way around. Right. As long as he didn't block the match, that's all that matters to me. Right, so now we've got to think about the SmackDown tag title situation at Elimination Chamber. Um, so I'm thinking just a normal tag team match. And then thinking Heat done, Tyler Bate. So this will be, I'm going to do like a little tournament for the tag titles, but the, basically, ultimately, the, um, yeah, hold on, two seconds. We could do lots of, lots of areas, can't we, for now? We'll do that then. We do, we're getting some more tag teams on the SmackDown roster, though. Or just getting rid of the, the tag titles on SmackDown, maybe. Anyway, right. We'll go steal the show. Open match, call in ring. Oh, that. Oh, no, no. All that match. Slow build. Decisive win. Allow. Allow. There we go. Uh, I don't have many on the tag. On the, I've noticed this. There's not many tag teams. Um, yeah, Mike Bailey is very good, Josh. Um, there's not many. They, there's not many tag teams on the SmackDown roster. So my my, especially on the heel side, my options are limited. So I do need to bring in some tag teams at some point. But yeah, we'll be alright for now. I probably won't actually do a tournament. I'll just do Pete Dunn and Tyler Bate versus Los Laparios for the vacant titles. So that's that match booked. Uh, I don't want to go too crazy with too many matches. I think we just need to do the main Elimination Chamber matches now. So we do, do the women's ones. So we do six-way singles. Chamber. There we go. Elimination Chamber. Right, I need time to think about this. Uh, 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 what title are we doing it for? Are we doing it for Raw or are we doing it for... Have a look. Let's see who the women's champions are again. We've got... Maybe he's not the women's champion. Ah, uh, maybe I could lean into that. Josh, did you accidentally put Bailey as the women's the SmackDown women's champion? Or is that just something that's come up on here? I'm not having a go at you, by the way, I'm just wondering. The Oscar's the women's champion on Raw, which which isn't true. It's supposed to be uh right, we're vacating these titles, we're we're fixing this. Vacating that one. There we go. Problem solved. Yeah. No, it's okay, mate. Don't worry. I'm not, I, I assumed it was something to do with that. So, yeah, don't worry. I'll fix it. It's all right. Right. Uh, so, we'll do the Raw one. So this will be the, for the Raw women's title. The Rhea Ripley, Becky Lynch. Uh, not Bianca, but hold on, we need to figure out if they're on, on the same brands. Becky Lynch is on Raw, Rhea Ripley's on Raw. Yep. Just need more women, more women. So we could do Alexa Bliss, Candice LeRae, Camella, Chelsea Green, Indy Hartwell, Ivy Nile. Liv Morgan, so maybe probably Liv Morgan would be one of them. Maybe Natalia. Shayna. So 
So I'm thinking Shana, Zoe, Natalia, Chelsea Green. There you go. Sorted. Everybody happy with that? For the Raw Women's title? We're going to do Rhea Ripley as the winner. Actually, no, I'm going to leave it. I'm going to see what happens. No, I've got to, I've got to because it will ruin me other plans. I'm going to have to do Rhea Ripley as the victor. So that is a spoiler, by the way, everyone. I do apologise, but uh, yeah. Oh, hold on a second. I swear I've got Rhea Ripley in the match at Royal Rumble, don't I? No, I haven't. Just ignore me. All right, Rhea Ripley. The car crash. Open match. Script. All that match. Slow build. Overbooked. Nice and win. Scroll all the way down to here. I wish so. I wish half of these you could just save automatic so you don't have to keep doing them. We do advanced storyline. Right. Oh, whatever, Triple H. I don't care. Triple H not happy again. Right, another half an hour, lads, and I'm going to call it a day. Um, but we're just going to keep going with this to try and book us. I'm going to try and do the first Raw show before I go. But it'll be basically like a real-life Raw. I'm going to try and book it like the real-life Raw. I want to keep everything real life up until we get to WrestleMania. And then after WrestleMania, I'm going to pretty much just book it how I want to book it in real life. Not in real life, as in how I want to book it. As, as best as possible, really, I think. Uh, yeah, so Akum and Razor are, um, they weren't in the WWE roster, I forgot to put them on there, so they will be on the roster. Um, same with Austin Fury, uh, Austin Fury's on the roster, but for some reason Grayson Waller isn't, so I'm going to bring him in. I got rid of Anderson and Gallows because I can't stand them. Humberto and Angel are already a tag team on SmackDown, they're going against, uh, British Strong Style, Tyler Bay and Pete Dunne's on there as well. I could add Rey Mysterio and Dragon Lee as a tag team as well, if need be. Yeah, the Street Profits are on there. Um, yeah, I think Dragon Lee's already in the LWO. I think I've already put him. But yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll do that now then. Good idea. Good idea, booking team. We'll call them LWO2. There you go. This is already an L. WO tag team. Yeah, because you've got the LWO tag team of um, Mendoza and um, Joe, Joe Keen Wild as well. So there's them as well. Right. Um, Dragon Lee went it. Yeah, sorry. There, I did. Let me just check that LWO has got Dragon Lee in there. No, he's not on there. Andrade's in there, by the way. Uh, We'll just add Dragon Lee. There you go. So LWO is updated now. Yeah, pretty deadly are on there as well. Yeah, so I'm, I am. I have made. A, I have put in an offer for Drew McIntyre because basically I try to get the contracts as realistic as possible. And as far as I know. Even though I'm assuming Drew McIntyre signed a new contract, um, it hasn't been made official yet, so I've put his contract to expire this month. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of a trios, uh, a trios title. Um, I might retire one of the tag team titles, unify the tag titles, uh, maybe at WrestleMania, and then and then add a trios title on the brand that I decide to get rid of the tag title, so maybe SmackDown will be where the Trio's title's on there. Who, who uh, Kalito. Ah, uh, I've got another booking idea for Kalito. So, uh, don't you worry about that, everyone. 
that is on the horizon. Right. Uh, I can't remember what I was doing. What was I doing? I've done that bit. I've done that bit. Oh, yeah. Pre-booking. There we go. Go back to Elimination Chamber for a minute. We now need to do the men's one now. Men's Elimination Chamber. In chamber, there we go. And unmute me, think. There we go. Right, so we've got the men's one coming up now. Um, let me think which one this is going to. I think this will be for the raw. Yeah, this one. Seth Rollins. I'm thinking Seth Rollins, Theon Punk. Let's see who else is on. Raw, so we've got baby faces first. Right, so we've got Andrade. Andrade, no, he's on SmackDown. Right. Big E, maybe. Might be a good way to bring Big E back. We've got Jey Uso. Oh, sorry, I had faces only there. Right, hold on. Let me do this. There we go. Let me just let me just go a little bit back. Let me do this a little bit easier for everybody. We go raw. Let me just check the chat. I don't want to miss anything. Sorry. Can't see anything happen. Do you mean you can't see anything on the screen, or do you mean? Oh, okay. Hold on then. Bear with us. I will sort this out. Energy feet. Is that any better? No? Is that any better? Oh, yeah, you can't see the next screen, can you? Okay, sorry. Okay. There you go. You can see that now, can't you? Do that. Sorry about this, everyone. It's just, it's just, it's just one of them things where we've just got to keep adding screens. You can see it now, can't you? Yeah? Cool. Right. There we go. So, got CM Punk. I've just done Raw Brand as well, so I think in Drew McIntyre. So, we've got Seth Rollins, maybe, I think Sami Zayn. Uh, not Triple H, obviously. Um, not Kofi Kingston, probably Jey Uso. Maybe Big E. Probably Big E. I'll just throw Big E in there. Oh, God, Josh. You have to take it there, don't you? You pervert. I still laugh when they did that. Um... Do you remember when the Usos did that? When they did that battle rap thing and they, uh, and they talked about Xavier Woods getting x-rated? That was hilarious. Yes, we we have all seen it. Unfortunately for for uh, Paige, aka Soraya, we have all probably seen it because we're all perverts, we're all men. All right, so I'm thinking Seth Rollins, CM Punk, Drew McIntyre, Sami Zayn, Jay Uso, and Big E for the Elimination Chamber main event match. Uh, yeah, there we go. So we'll do that. We'll do this. Add it like that. We'll add heavyweight title on the line. Um, I'm going to leave this. I'm not going to. Can you see that? I don't think you can. Um, you're not missing much on the second, the other screen. I'm I'm looking at anyway. We'll do spectacle, open match, script, all that match, slow build, overbook, decisive win. Allow spinal impact moves, allow high risk moves, advanced storyline. Because I think we've got. No, we haven't. Okay. Fine. Triple H ain't happy with any of my booking ideas, is he? Elimination Chamber's looking pretty good, isn't it, Lance? What do you reckon? 
I don't think he's. I don't think CM Punk's injured on this. I think I've seen. What Tony Storm's done a sex tape, by the way. Are you telling me that I've, there's a Tony Storm sex tape and I've missed it? Oh damn it! Right. Um. We need, we, we've got to be different now, lads. We can't be. We can't be glorifying women, sexualizing women now. Come on. Anyway. <laughs> right. So we have got Becky Lynch versus Tiffany Stratton. That'll be a showcase match for Tiffany Stratton, but Becky Lynch will keep we keep anyway. We won't we won't talk about that too much, right? And then we've got Bianca Belair and Jay Cargill. Because they are former short term tag team. And they'll go against Kabuki Warriors for the titles. And then we've got British Song style, which is Tyler Bate and Pete Dunn, for people who don't know, versus Lot Laferios, um, for the tag, SmackDown tag titles. And then we've got Tim Ballon and Damian Priest versus Austin Truth versus DIY in a tag team elimination chamber match. And we've got Rhea Ripley versus Beck Lynch versus Shayna Baszler versus Zoe Stark versus Natalia versus Chelsea Green uh, for the women's, t uh, women's title on that one. And then we've got CM Punk, Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, Sami Zayn, Jey Uso and Big E in the other one. Right, that's enough for the Elimination Chamber. So we're going to go about booking our first Raw show. Don't get too excited because it's going to be try. It's going to try and be as accurate as possible to real life. Right, hold on. Can you see this? You can't see. Oh, you can. That's all right. Right, you can see all that, can't you? You can see backstage incident. Yeah, yeah. So we'll get this show on the road now. Sorry it took so long, lads. I'm just very thorough about doing it all. I wanted to get it all in place. So, right, okay. So, Pat McAfee. View. Pat McAfee, lift it. Can you see the, the what it's come up? No, you can't. Okay. Bear with us. I'm going to add another screen. Right, there you go. You can see that, can't you? I just want to make sure you lot can see what I'm seeing so you don't miss out. I know. Ridiculous, isn't it, Josh? Absolutely ridiculous. Right, so Pat McAfee lifted the crowd, lifted the locker room when organised and then won. Sorry, I can't get my words out today. And then won a video game tournament. So, there we go. Pat McAfee, a good lad. Right, let's do... Can you see that one? Yeah, you can see it just about. I'll just pull this up here. Right, has that moved it for you? No. I did pull that screen so you could see it, but it didn't work. Uh, actually, I won't do any locker room control things. Right. Let's book it. So. If we're basing this on the first Raw of January, uh, 2024, Nia Jax, beat it. Nia Jax defeated Becky Lynch. Well, I got rid of Nia Jax, didn't I? Because I can't stand her. So, we are going to do Tiffany Stratton versus Becky Lynch. How many minutes was it? 11 minutes. Yeah. Do that. 12 minutes. You can't, can you see that? Yeah, you can see it. Okay. All right, so I'm going to um, get rid of one of these, I think. I'll just move it over here. No, I won't. Uh, hold on. All right. We get rid of these now. Just bear with us, everyone. I'm trying to do this right. I'm trying not to spoil it for you. There is a logic in my uh, thinking here.
Right, there we go. Bear with us, I am booking it. I just want to try and keep it surprised. I'm still here. Don't worry. All right, that's that. Oh, Becky Lynch is furious. Hmm. I'm going to do it anyway. Becky Lynch is not happy with me and my booking. I'll leave it as that. Right, so what happened? Isn't there usually like a 20 minute promo to start Raw? I think it's just giving me the I think it's just giving me the match results here and not actually what happened on Raw. Oh no, it did start with that. Um Right, okay. Yeah, just give me five ten minutes to book this, lads. Talk amongst yourselves if you want. Let me let me know what you're doing tonight, or let me know what you're doing over the weekend. Keep the conversation going while I'm doing this. If you don't, if you want, no worries. If you don't want to, just just chill and try and watch me. I bet you do, you lucky bugger. Do they have any different personality traits, or they? But because obviously twins, just because they're twins, they are probably different, aren't they? So it's like one will be a bit more like fiery. Um, one might like rock music, the other one might like dance music, or something like that. I don't know. I don't really have much experience with twins.
Why can't, why can't I have Michael? Mm. For some reason, I can't have Michael Cole in the Raw announced team. Hold on. I'll figure that out in a second. Uh, I need to book an angle, don't I? I need to book Becky Lynch to back with Ripley after the match. I feel like I feel like I think I think I I, I don't know I, I I still think Dave's trolling us, Josh. I still think he's trolling us. I could be wrong there. Uh -uh. I am slowly getting there, booking the show, by the way. I am trying. I will get quicker eventually. Because I'm trying to get it accurate to how it is in real life, that's what it is. If it was just me booking it, I'd be a lot quicker. How many minutes was that one? That oh, was only six minutes. Uh, we've done that. We just need to pop this up here. No, uh, what have I done here? Oh, 
All right, it's shaping up all right now at the moment. Getting there. Yeah, it seems to be the best mob, doesn't it, for it? Um, right, we're nearly finished, I think. Well, I say that, but we've, we've still got a bit to do yet. Just to fill it, fill it up a bit. Uh, Seth Rollins defeated Drew McIntyre. So, had match. How was Cody Rhodes not on this show? Cody Rhodes has been on every single Raw, so... The Rock made an appearance, didn't he? I think we need to put the Rock promo in here at some point. So, there. Uh, just do this. One participant. So we'll do this here, like so. Rock was, I think it was in the middle of the show, wasn't it? There we go. Um, right, how long, how much longer have we got? Booked. So it needs to be We've got eighty five pissing more minutes to book. Ay 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 ay. Giving me the matches, but it's not giving me the like the angles and stuff like that, which is annoying. I assume I assume Seth Rollins and Drew McIntyre did some sort of back and forth as well. Do that. We'll do we'll do Drew McIntyre challenging Seth. What's the max we can do for that? Oh five minutes. Well that's a bit rubbish, isn't it? Doesn't help.
All right. Um, we we'll probably need to do a segment with our truth and judgment day. Do do five. Uh, in Bala Nears we've got Johnny Gargano in here we'll just put those in here so I'll do uh, Tommaso Ciampa right what's the Add on. Add on. Bear with us. There we go. Four and one attack. So we will do Damien Priest, Dominic Mysterio, JD McDonough, and Banner, and then we'll have our truth. I'm just going to put a match at the start just to bump and get the crowd going. Even though it's not real life what happened, but I need to fill some time. We'll do Walter. Who's Walter going against? Uh, exclude already booked. We we'll do Walter versus Chad Gable because I know you lot like Chad Gable. Sorry, I'm going quiet. I'm just trying. I can't multitask if you haven't gathered. Why can't I find the Intercontinental title? Hmm. Yeah, so why can't I? Why can't I put that title on? Gosh, any idea? I think there are penalties if you run it shorter. I don't think you can run it shorter or longer anyway. Um, I think you're stuck with what you got, really. Um, I just don't understand why it won't let me do this kind of time. Am I being really stupid here? Why can't I find it on here? Not letting me, even though it's saying... Uh, titles intercontinental. Where are you? Edit. Ah, that's why. It was because it was on the SmackDown. Still won't let me. Why is it not letting me? Ah, oh, this is so annoying. Right, we'll book it for now. Right, now if I go back into here, hopefully it'll let me do it. There we go. Oh, so annoying. Right, there we go. So, we've done 129 minutes. We've still got to do, we've got to do some more bloody booking here. Uh, so, which is around 75% matches. You're currently 72. So, okay. So, we do need to do... Uh, we want to attack. We do Ludwig, Giovanni, 
I was three on two, what am I on about? We did Walter. We did Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods getting attacked. So many angles on here, it's so boring. This is why I prefer AEW because you can do a lot more wrestling matches and less bloody storyline bullshit. Sorry for swearing. Um, and then we'll do we'll do two versus two. Do that. And then we'll do Kofi and Xavier. This is Ludwig and Giovanni. We're near the end, everyone. We're near the end. The Kofi and Xavier there. We'll, uh, Keep strong, Lovely Kaiser, not too bothered about Giovinci. With the match, script, all that match, slow build, over book. What we'll do is we'll have Big E come back to distract him. There you go. We're nearly there, everyone. We're nearly there. Right, how long have we got left to book now? 19 more bloody minutes. I know, but if I change the product type, it will alienate a lot of the things. That's what happened. A lot of the fans in it. That's what the annoying thing about it, though. Right, we ain't got long left now. We've just got 19 minutes to book. Um, so we're still in line. We just need to book. We're just going to do a simple match now. Do a women's match. Female. And we'll do Liv Morgan. We'll have her against Chelsea Green. We'll just do storytelling. Let the match. Next with Morgan. And script. Nice win. Do that and now we'll just pop that up in the middle of the card as the fist break. Um, we just need to add seven more minutes, we'll put that as a promo. We'll do a new day, and um, we'll do um, we Ripley Imbala. Dominic, Damien, JD, there we go. Right, we're ready, everyone. We are finally ready. Hold on, before I carry on. Imperium wrestling twice. No, Imperium's not. Are they? Let me check. Am I balls up here? So, Walter's going against Chad Gable, and then I did a backstage segment where Imperium attacked the New Day, and then the New Day went against Imperium, the tag team, not the stable. Um, ah, uh, balls, yeah, you're right. Ah, okay. What we're going to do 
Yeah. You know what? I'm going to get rid of the Imperium Trophy Kingston Jey Uso. And then we'll do Jey Uso. Thank you for letting me know about that, everyone. I do apologize. I obviously didn't tweet. Heels. We'll do Dominic Mysterio. Uh, open match. Script. Yeah. Right, there you go. Right, is everything all right now? Thank you, by the way, for pointing that out. Sorry. Right, I'm just about to start it. I just want to know. Is there any other errors that I've missed? Let me know. And then I need to get this green up in a sec. I'll just wait for Right, I'm gonna I'm assuming everything's gonna be right, so I'm gonna start the show now. I can always change it in pre-booking. Right, so let me just see what you can see. See, you can see that, that's good. Booking analysis. Oh, balls off, I didn't see that. Um, let me go back to the booking screen in a second. So we had a little promo with Judgment Day, got a rating of 60. Rhea Ripley clearly enjoyed having the freedom to go off script. So that's good. Booking analysis, there we go. Becky Lynch is furious with the booking. Well, that's fine. Apparently Ludwig Vorga, Ludwig Vorga, Ludwig Vorga, Ludwig Kaiser is being booked too much. Um, I do need to check, I do need to change some of these things actually. Because Michael Cole is not on here for some reason, and I don't know why. So I'm going to have to put Wade Barrett in there for now. I think it's because I put Michael Cole on SmackDown and Wade Barrett on Raw. So just bear with me. And then we'll go back in a second. Just need to put Wade Barrett in every single one of these bloody things. Wade Barrett. So annoying we have to do this. I wish there was like a thing where you can just change it overall. Uh, I don't know whether I should change this now, to be honest. Uh, I'm going to change this. So, Becky Lynch will win that match just because I simply don't want to piss her off because she is one of my top women's wrestlers. I don't want to piss her off. But Tiffany Stratton will be going over strong. So she will be protected. Uh, and then after that, I will probably put Tiffany Stratton on a winning streak, hopefully. So... Eventually, when they wrestle again, Becky Lynch won't be so furious. So she will get a win over Becky Lynch eventually. I just need to push her first. Nearly finished, everyone. Nearly finished. Oh, there's so many segments. Oh. No, I don't. I want this one here. Thank you. All right, we're done. All right, uh, let me just check the chats in case I've missed anything. Yeah, I'm thinking I meant to swap. I did it already by accident. Yeah. 
So, um, no, I can't change the announcers now, but I put, I, put, I put Wade Barrett in there for now. So, yeah, I've done that. I've made a strong. I forgot to make it two hours, Josh. I might do that when I finish off here in a minute. So, yeah, because it is, it is a ball ache, isn't it? Right, let's continue the show. So, Jey Uso defeated Dominic Mysterio. Got a segment rating of 55. Can you see this? You can see this, yeah. Uh, having nobody with the announcing skill on commentary. So having two colour commentators cost me. So I don't think there's any announcers I can put in there. They're all colour commentators, I think. Rhea Ripley did some good work at ringside. The match was too short for an important match in the eyes of the audience. Right, in a decent match, Walter defeated Chad Gable in 22 minutes with the Golden Bomb. Gets a second round 52. That's disappointing. Uh, Walter's in ring performance was only 62. Again, penalised because of the announcing thing. Match dragged at the end. So basically, I did it too long and it was too fast paced for too long. And they both got tired, so obviously they can't uh, wrestle for that long. That's my fault. See, we learn these things as we go along. Yeah, they will, Josh, but it's learning curve, innit? We'll get there. Yeah. Exactly, they need to, don't they? Probably, yeah, you're probably right, Josh. I probably did put too many notes in there. I think I'll just do storyline one uh, matches, storytelling matches from now on, and then when it's like the main event, maybe I'll just have the main event as something a, bit, a little bit better. Right then. Uh, yeah, announcing segment. Uh, 36 match reign. Jesus Christ. Well. Crowd were increasingly restless and noisy. The match became move and move overbooked. Really, yeah. The crowd got really turned off by the start of match this was. Uh, announcers said that the rocks come in. Liv Morgan. Defeated Chelsea Green in 10 minutes with a submission. And he got 52 match rating. But at least I and Drew could rescue us with a promo. So everything went well with that. Let me just check the chat to make sure. So just leave it as what, like a regular match then. I just assumed that any match that wasn't. DM Hunk, where'd you get DM Hunk from? DM Hunk. At least this one went relatively well. Mostly greens here. Well, that's only a promo though, isn't it? That segment went well. Oh, uh, in the case you're pre-booking here. Yeah, it's fine. Um, yeah, so... Becky Lynch defeated different, uh, Tiffany Stratton. Tiffany Stratton, not a very good ring performance. Oh, Becky Lynch has got an injury. That is not... So we've got an injury already. Oh, is he called DM Hunk now? Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, I might need to talk to Josh next time before I book this to make sure I get the booking part of this right. Okay, so we've got Becky in, Becky Lynch is injured, so that ruins literally all of our plans for the women's title now. Unless it's like a short-term injury and we can, we can sort that out. The Rock rescued us with a backstage promo. R-Truth and The Miz show excellent chemistry together, which is good. 
Uh, Maurice did work, work, good work, good chemistry between him and the, her and the Miz, which is understandable. Rhea Ripley did well backstage uh, at ringside. Rick, the match was too short. Okay, fair enough. Rhea Ripley defeated Ivy Nile, but we we tried to make sure that we protected Ivy Nile as best as possible. We had Becky Lynch attack Rhea Ripley afterwards. Rhea, Becky Lynch was a real star in this segment, which is good. Uh, the Hunters, which is the tag team name I've called Zoe Stark and Shayna Baszler, they destroyed Natalia and Tegan Knox. And then we had Seth Rollins versus Drew McIntyre, uh, which had sensational wrestling and fantastic heat, but only got a 67 match rating, which is a bit annoying. Uh, maybe it should have gone a little bit longer, but Seth Rollins won. Yeah, too short. I think if it was a bit longer, we probably would have. Oh, hold on. I swear I didn't do it at 10 minutes. That's a balls up, that is. Um, that match was meant to be 18 minutes, so I don't know how it went only 10 minutes, but yeah. Right, finish show. So we've lost popularity in 20 regions. Oh, Jesus Christ. We only got a 70 rating. Um, we would have gained popularity in six Mexican regions, but growth was restricted due to the limited number of viewers there. So we might need to look at expanding our TV regions in certain areas. But yeah, that was a, a thank you for everybody that put up with all that. Hopefully over time it will get quicker. I might, I might get the auto booker to book some of the shows. Um, but yeah, but we we know it's been a decent stream. I'm just gonna wait for this to load up, see if there's any news items worth showing you. But yeah, it's been a pretty good um stream. I do appreciate everyone for helping all that lot. Make sure I know. Yeah, so basically, with the thing with Michael Cole and that, I didn't know. Uh, turn off injuries. I think it makes it more realistic though with injuries though. I think if you turn off injuries, I think it makes it too easy. I need to change the product, but I can't change it too much because it will uh ruin the it will ruin the the fan base, won't it? Yeah, I might keep injuries low then. Oh okay, I'll do style style. Okay, let me bear with us then. Let me do this before I forget. So, where is it? Product, product, product. Have I just gone past it? There it is, product. So, uh, hold on. Where do I change it? Change it, there we go. Ah, oh, it won't let us. The company board has blocked your attempt to change the product base. They don't wish to change anything until a new owner is in place. Oh, okay then. Right then. Uh, uh, can you see what I'm showing you? Yeah, you can. Right, okay. So, now what, Josh? I'm in the in-game editor, now what do I do? Is it, in is it this one? Yeah, in-game editor. Is it companies? Do I go to company? Team WWE company. Products. There we go. Can you see that? You can't see that. I don't bear with us. Is it this one, Josh? How do I... Uh... Let me just read all the messages first. Go to WWE, go to product change. Plans booker, maybe turn off the... 
No, I think Triple H. I think I did it as owner, didn't I? Triple H as the owner. Oh, no, I couldn't have because they wouldn't have said that they're waiting for a new owner. Maybe turn off auto save so you mistake you can reload. Injuries are too, uh, injuries to low or low. Change core and corrupt and start to no style style. Oh, okay. Ah, there we go. Thank you, Josh. Do I need to, where it says, what about current product? Do I do the same for current product? Oh, a current product. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Right, okay. No style, style. Okay. Is there anything else on here before I leave this that you, you want me to change? Well, I've got that screen off. Anything else? Now, less angles, all good. Okay. So where it says angle focus, what do I put for angle focus? Or... Do I not, do I not change anything on... Leave, leave it. So just leave angle focus and match focus as it is, yeah? What about... Booking stop, leave that as well. Okay, I'll just leave it as that. Okay. Right. What was the other things I need to do? Uh, let me just go back. Stop typing. Oh, hold on. Auto save. Okay. Auto save. It's in options, isn't it? Oh, it's here somewhere, isn't it? Where is it? Well, am I really thick? Why can't I... Ah, save settings, there we go. No, that's just save them, isn't it? Um, I thought that meant like as in settings for save. Why can't I see it? Is it right there when I'm being... Ah, auto save, for fuck's sake. Sorry for swearing, everyone. I just feel like an idiot there. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, Josh. Injuries, injuries, okay, injury frequency, low, save, right, anything else? I'm tired now, that's probably why I'm making mistakes, sorry. Announcer, yeah, good idea, let's get that done before we go. Announcers, events, raw, see on here though, it says raw brand. Can you see? It says here. It says Michael Cole and um. Let me look at brand split. Let me scroll down. Ah, there you go. So we try to roar, and then Wade Barrett. Ray Barrett's smack down there. Okay. Right, is that it? Do you think that's it, do you reckon? Is there anything else? Yeah, I could I just I'll just I've done it now, I'll fix it. Is there anything else, yeah? Corey on SmackDown. Uh let me just check. Yeah, Corey's on SmackDown and Pat McAfee's on Raw. So I must have just, it just must have not worked when I did it before because I remember doing it. Yeah, Corey's definitely on SmackDown. Wade Barrett. Wade Barrett and William Regal. So we've got Wade Barrett and William Regal. Actually, hold on. Is William Regal on SmackDown? Let me just check. William Regal. No, he's on Raw. He... No, he's not. He's unbranded. So actually, I can leave William Regal as unbranded and he can be on 
we have a look at the announcers again. So for the events, it's uh, the actual main events, like the, 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 the pay-per-views, it's Mark Cole, Corey Graves, and Pat McAfee. We'll just do Raw TV. Uh, Raw TV is Michael Cole and Pat McAfee. I might add somebody else, actually. Mm, no. Uh, and then SmackDown TV is... I could do with an announcer on here, couldn't I? Oh, no, Corey Grace is an announcer. That's fine. Yeah. Right. Yeah, the, the, the refs are unbranded, yeah. Yeah, William Regal's unbranded, so he can be on either one. Corey, Corey and Wade are on SmackDown. Um, yeah. No, no, the refs are unbranded. Right, that's it, innit? I'm going to call it a day. Is there anything else before I go? Do you reckon, Josh? I think it's just you and me, innit, now? <laughs> I think everybody else has disappeared. Right, then, everyone. Thank you for putting up with it. It's been a bit of a slog, I know. But, yeah, thank you. Um, thank you, Josh. Thank you, GBR, Z. Thank you, um, Bazinga. Thank you, uh, the resting guy, Dave. I think that's everybody that's been on today. But anyway, if I missed you, I apologize. But thank you to all your support. I am off to rest now because my head's boggled. So that's it. Dave and the twins. We're gonna have we're gonna have them as a stable on on uh, on Raw, I think. Dave. We're gonna I'm gonna edit one of the wrestlers, have him pair have him in a in a stable with the Bella twins, I think. Right. I'm off. I'll be back. Oh, oh yeah, that's a, that's another thing I need to tell you. So I'll be on here tomorrow, but it's going to be early tomorrow. So it'll probably be... I'll message you, Josh, personally, but I think at a guess, it's probably going to be about... Maybe, I think it'll probably be about... Uh, hold on, let me think. Probably about 10 a.m. Probably about 10 a.m. 10, 10, half 10-ish in the morning. I'll message you, Josh. But for the others, just keep an eye on, if you're not following me on Twitch, which I think most of you are, follow me on Twitch and then you'll know when I'm coming on. But it'll be about half 10 UK time, um, JBRS, in case you might not be awake at that time. So, yeah. But right, I'm off. Thank you, everyone. Speak to you soon. Bye.